Hi everybody, this is Dave Aquino with Basecamp Trading and this is the free video for Tuesday, February 25th, 2020. So looking at the markets first, yesterday, massive gap down on Monday, a strong downside move to follow. We were down over three and a half percent. Now historically, so to speak, in the past 10 years, Tuesdays have always been kind of redemption day, uh, for the markets that had a bad day on Monday to have a turnaround. So they've actually named the Tuesday days as Turnaround Tuesday. Well, guess what? Not today. And uh, the market proceeded to open relatively flat, actually positive about 15 points, and immediately turned down to run down all, you know, minus 50, minus 55 at the low. Uh, and here we are at minus 48. Uh, we're down over one and a half percent. So no turnaround Tuesday. And the way I was looking at this, we had a couple of days lower Thursday uh, and Friday last week. Monday and Tuesday of this week, we're heading lower. I think we have one additional day moving lower down towards 3150. A lot depends on how we close and if we continue to get uh, bad news or at least no good news uh, that the market perceives because again this market is sliding lower I feel like the major uh, holdings in the S&P 500 Apple Microsoft uh, Amazon Facebook and um, and Alphabet are starting to find a little bit of equilibrium so that they may not be as bearish but usually these things happen in three day patterns. So I think there's a good opportunity price to come down at least touch 3150 and then start a potential rebound, possibly even back up towards the 50 day EMA. Again, we've gone a little bit uh, quickly to the downside. We're about six and a half percent to the downside from the all time high and uh, the market might stabilize a little bit. Uh, here at 3150 and then uh, make a little bit of a rebound and then we'll see how the news continues to come out. If there are more outbreaks in different developed countries, uh, the market is going to continue to fall. OK, so just be keep your one eye on the news, one eye on the market, and I think you'll have your their bases covered and you'll be able to see which way the market's going. OK, thanks a lot.